Yeah, come Woo. on. Street Boys. Oh, hello, everybody, and welcome uh. to Street Boys. Uh. My name is War Drums. On my uh, one side here, I have Six Rock, and That's on me. the other, Ricky. Yep. Uh, and they're going to help me uh, try and make this as good of an experience for everybody as possible. Um, I think we have time during the run to go into what all of this Street Boys is all about. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, but if you, during the run ever, like especially here in the audience, get so overtaken with the motion of how amazing this game is, that you simply cannot hold it in anymore, just shout out Street Boys. Yep. Just yell it out. <laughs> just, just yell it out. Get it out of your body. Um, but yeah, I think we're just gonna gonna start the game and uh, start the run, and, and then we uh, we take it from there. So, uh, Ricky, if you are uh, yep on the button. All right. Okay. You know what to uh, yell. Yeah. In three, two, two one. one. Street boys. Let's go. Let's All get it. All right. So um, this is a, a Japanese budget game. Uh, we play as Jin who is a uh, tough-looking street boy. Trapped in a prison for no apparent reason. Trapped in a prison for no apparent reason. We, uh, we're in this thug-ruled uh, kind of country. Um, and, and we meet our initial rival here, Shisuke. Um, we have some beef with him. We don't really know why. And, but we don't really get to settle that. So we just get put in... A, Discrimination Office, <laughs> which is this game's uh, word for prison. Prison, yeah. Um, there's, a, there's a common theme with this game where they obviously just use any translation service, <laughs> put the words in there, and they're just like, yeah, that's the one. Yeah. <laughs> we'll use that for the game. That's it. Yeah, so, so we're going to escape with the help of our new uh, inmate friend, Ginji. Um, and uh, already here, we're going to do the first little trick of the game because... Uh, Doors are kind of optional for us in this game, and we're just gonna use the uh, enemies to uh, say nope. <laughs> there we yeah, go. That, that skips a cutscene with getting the key to actually yeah. open that door. This, we, this we game's collision with like enemies pushing through you through things is uh, pr pretty fire. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, and we're gonna use that on uh, a bunch of levels, uh, most notably later in this level, actually, to uh, do a little bit of a sequence break, uh, because for a lot of the levels, or for some of the levels, you're supposed to revisit them later on. Um, we're actually only going to do that once in this run. Um, but yeah, this is both the first level and one of the last levels. Um, so we're going to do a little bit of a sequence break here by utilizing an enemy that is normally trapped behind a door. That's why we go and open up that uh, this door here. We're just going to grab him. <laughs> this is a uh, oh. special item that we're going to need later on. Um, and uh, we're going to carry him up here, back to the uh, control panel. Let's see if we can get this door. Nice. nice. Okay. <laughs> that is way harder than it looks. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Street boys? Yeah, so the reason that's genuinely difficult is because any time the camera changes, like the direction you're holding is no longer the direction you were holding. Yeah, the camera just goes all over the place in this game. So if you're holding right, it would just go like, you would just go like in and then back out. Yeah, like exactly. within like. Two frames, literally. On top of that, oh god. Oh god. Uh, on top of that, this uh, game has no dead zones for your controller. So you, if you see me stutter all the, like back and forth a little bit the entire time, that that's why it's genuinely hard to hold like a, a single direction and the straight line. Yeah, so right. going uh, in a straight line is the hardest thing in this game. All right, so it this genuinely. clip is actually a big skip coming up. Let's see if we can get it. First try, yeah, let's funny. go. That's how we needed Good. that enemy. Uh, so coming up is uh, the first boss we're gonna fight, which is technically like the second to last boss. Um, but that doesn't matter, <laughs> even though we uh, <laughs> even though we, we level up during a run uh, and and get more stronger and stronger. Uh, there is a I guess I, I think it's just an exploit that we found where if you and your partner input damage onto the same enemy. Um, the game kind of overlaps it and doesn't know how, like which damage instance uh, needs to take priority, so it just like alternates between them. Oh. And you can overlap that with uh, the opponent's attack as well to just deal massive amount yeah, of damage. Yeah, it's really bad with just dealing with simultaneous damage in any direction. Yeah. So nope. I'm going to try and see if we can get it here uh, and basically insta-kill him. Yeah, pay attention to the health bar. No, oh no, I, oh, that's bad. <laughs> I completely, okay. 
<laughs> That's actually really bad. Um, what do we do here? Okay, we, we're gonna improvise a little bit. You might still see yeah, head on the Genji. Yeah. Uh, you'll see it later on for sure. Okay, so we're gonna we, need, we need Genji to attack him here. Yeah. He's missing. Uh, this is bad. But you saw it a little bit there. Please. Like, like that. Okay. okay. Yeah. So, so if you miss, you're gonna see this. Press buttons. And everybody, stare down. Stare down. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, this is uh, a very long sequence that takes like 15, 20 seconds that we uh, can have on basically every single uh, boss fight, more or less. Um, and we do definitely want to skip those, if possible. And come on. Ah, uh, bad timing. My yeah. bad. Gigi's just standing there. Yeah, get him. He is get him, man. Cooperating at all right now. We okay. want basically we want Genji to do this three uh, like oh he's just squatting. Okay, here's oh we want him to do this attack where he's attacking oh, three come times on, Genji. and then on the third hit right here. There we oh, go. That, come on. that was a lot of nice damage. Come on, no scared. Come on. Ah oh, come on. Get him. <laughs> just take yeah that that attack sucks. Come on. So yeah, if you don't get the quick kill on this guy, it just takes forever to kill him because... Okay, there no seconds okay. there down, though. No, that's fine. Ooh, yeah, almost fine, yeah. actually. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was close. Ooh. Okay. We move. So yeah, as Wardrum was calling it a sequence break, it basically, it only skips like the first level. Even though yeah. this is like the second to last thing, it doesn't actually unlock anything else. But it skips us having to go back into that level Here's later the text on. mashing. <laughs> Fire. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it's so satisfying in this game. All right, this is a thing you don't see in like NG Plus stuff. Yep. Because this is just a shopping street, but you have to go beat up this kid. Yeah. You have to beat up Shosuke <laughs> yeah, again. Yeah, we actually get to have our uh, beef with Shosuke now. Yeah, he's pretty much the only boss in the game that doesn't do stare downs. That's like the main time loss you'll see throughout like most of the run is if you miss stare downs, oh, it's just wow. like an instant 15, 20 seconds. But Shosuke does not have a stare down, so it's not too bad. And he's also yeah, like yeah. fairly weak. Yeah, in case uh, you haven't been able to tell, this is just a uh, this is a beat em up game yeah. with terrible combat. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's awful. Yeah. I love how. <laughs> <laughs> I love how we've just not addressed the drip. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Wardrums is dressed up as Jin or Shin, uh, according to the back of the box of this yeah, game. They just got it all wrong. There's inconsistencies with everything in this game. Yeah, the final boss's name is also just. I think Goki on the back of the box, but it's like Kyoki yeah. in the actual game. It's just all over the place. So after beating uh, Shusuke here, he actually joined our team, but we're not going to use him unless the game forces us to on uh, one specific level. Also, in, check out in, this in, music, in this, though. In this level, us commentators have a very important job of just shutting up. Yep. Listen to this synth right here. This fire. They, under, they underpaid this man who made this soundtrack. It is so good. <laughs> All the budget went into the soundtrack. Oh, I got the budget. Oh, nice. That is yeah. not the easiest jump. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Street Ooh. boys. <laughs> but yeah, we just... Oh, that's the wrong way. Uh, we're going to do a little bit of running here. So if you have any donations, now would probably be a, a good time to put in those. Absolutely. We have an anonymous $6 donation that goes to the Super Hexagon 100%. <laughs> Uh, the final hexagon incentive. Uh, so just want to remind you, everyone, when you donate, make sure to check out the bid wars and incentives to, you know, change how things are played or unlock more games and so on. Uh, there's some really cool stuff there. Uh, we also have $25 from Robo Sparkle with the message, Breed Stories. <laughs> <laughs> Pavement lads. <laughs> Hardest part in the game right now. Yeah, the camera yes. changes here. Th that are camera brutal. changes. Oh, that was rough. That was pretty good. I'm, I'm yeah. happy with that. <laughs> Didn't go up the stairs. Yes. The stairs of shame. Yeah, they have like magnets on them. <laughs> yeah. I swear. <laughs> this cutscene is pretty hilarious, but yeah, we're gonna uh, we, we're gonna skip every cutscene. Yeah, we're gonna we're not gonna get to see it, but they're like standing on this. They just appear. Yeah. You can, you can run behind that trigger. Yeah. There's just like a hole on the left side there. You can you can definitely see a lot of like assets like reused as well. 
There's like the same bikes and like yeah. things like that. If you actually pick up a bike or like any object in this game and just throw it in a straight line, it just doesn't like. There's no it, gravity. Yeah, there's no gravity, so it just keeps flying all the way down until it like fades off screen. So Jin just has that much power in his arms. He's a strong, tough looking street boy. Yeah, he's tough. You know, don't mess with Jin. Okay, so uh, next boss coming up here, and uh, we're just gonna no, do a little bit no. of jump here. Oh, nice. Money. Um, and uh, I have a setup for this, so we'll see if I can uh, actually get it. It's a little bit finicky, but not too bad. There's definitely more finicky boss strats later on. Um, all right, so let's see. That looks good. Oh, you with? Nah. There we oh. go. Yeah, nice. Yeah. Good one. So, so that was based. <laughs> <laughs> That was basically what the first fight was supposed to look like, where you just, like, annihilate the boss. Um, there are two bosses later on that we don't, uh, that I haven't found a uh, dead-on skip for yet. Um, so if, if anybody feels like grinding those out and fighting those, I'll be uh, massively in-depth to you. Or something. I'm the only one running, running this game, so it doesn't <laughs> really matter. Or running <laughs> this category specifically. <laughs> yeah, most of the, most of the like... Uh, Speedrunning time with this game has gone into ILs or NG plus all stages, more or less. In, uh, in the new oh, game plus God. categories, you run like at twice the speed basically because of something called speed tickets, which you'll actually see uh, in this level as Wardrum is uh, on the third floor is going to get one of these speed tickets, which is going to speed him up uh, significantly. Yeah, we can't equip it until we are out of the level. Also, we have room strats. This guy holds a key to the next floor, and yes, it is literally faster to just just spam the first hit of everything over and over again. Yeah. If you if you continue the combo, you'll knock him down, and there's no great move to hit him when he's on the ground. So you, you, you can kick him. You but, can but kick him, but it's it's, it's, it's slow and laggy, and you have to wait. So usually you just have to wait for him to get back up. Yeah, just a Molotov casually being thrown at me <laughs> in, in a school. <laughs> yeah, this school is not safe. Yeah, no. it's, it's, the ex it's Bakuretsu High School. It's Explosion oh, yeah, High School. Oh, yeah, that's true. Oh, yeah, yeah that's right. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that that, that that was what that meant. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, you touched upon it a little bit uh, with the with the speedrunning history. Will you, uh, Ricky, tell a little bit about how we got to know this game? Yeah, I think sure. A good time for that. Yeah. So I mean, Five I wasn't years ago. Yeah, I wasn't really intending on this becoming big or anything, but it just kind of happened. Yeah. So I just went to this bookstore randomly one day, and I saw the word PS2 on like the front of the store, and. Uh, I don't know, I just, this game was like five bucks. I picked this game up with another game called DNA Dark Native Apostle. The game we don't talk about? Yeah. <laughs> uh, and uh, we just tried them both out and Street Boys just kind of ended up sticking because it had like an in-game timer. We started looking it up. We had people that knew like how to read Japanese. Yeah. Uh, and the in-game timer was just like a huge factor. So we brought the game to ESA 2019 and we tried to get everybody to Speedrun this stage's revisit, yeah. which is the shortest stage in the game. Yeah, we're gonna see it a little later, but but very slow. <laughs> yeah, because it is any percent. And uh, we ended up getting like a massive tie at like 25 seconds until the tie got broken by Cool Kid yeah. uh, to 24. So now only 15-ish people have 24 right now. It's still the easiest rec IL record in the game, but it still does take a little bit of grinding. Yeah. So that's kind of how it came to be. It's uh, it's I mean, it's a wonderful game. I'm glad we found it because yeah. it's got a lot to offer. So this is basically like the five-year anniversary of us finding this game. Yeah, yeah it actually is. Pretty it's much. Quite crazy. Yeah, it's already. That's time flies. Yeah, that jump kick he does at the end basically uh, makes him like fade out quicker. Nice camera. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the camera in this is your biggest enemy for sure. <laughs> yeah. So if you were to just um, finish that guy off with like just the normal broom swipe. Uh, he would just like slowly like and just like lay down and die slowly so then he wouldn't be able to get the key as quickly so that jump kick at the end is intentional so we grabbed the top floor key and now we're heading all the way down to the first floor yeah, to we're open, heading the, back open to the, the gym basically yeah so uh, another donation would probably be perfectly fine here absolutely we have a donation of 25 dollars from dragon saying street boys, street boys. <laughs> thank you very much Dree, for that uh, so coming up here, we have uh, a small little uh, goon that has a wooden sword that I'm going to grab because we have a lot of combat coming up, and uh, that just helps speed it up a little bit. Yeah, the, um, ra the range on is just a little bit better. Than no, the, 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 the range the is basically the same, but it does a lot more damage. Oh, okay. Where, yeah. Uh, so yeah, this guy is just going to oh, throw him down and kick him. 
Yeah. And grab the sword. Um. Oh, whoops. <laughs> we made it. Manual. Let's split up. <laughs> Let's split up. <laughs> it's like yes and no. So yeah, these guys that we, we're gonna fight now, uh, with the broom they die in three hits, but with this sword they die in two. I'm gonna try and see if I can hit as many as possible with each swing, uh, just to, to yeah kill them faster. Yeah. yeah, to avoid that that slowdown, which yeah yeah. Uh, that's bad. Yeah, they're really hard to groove out. Also, they'd like to do this thing where they just do this <laughs> every now and then. Uh, after this fight, you're gonna see something that doesn't uh, happen in New Game Plus runs either. We're gonna be fighting Mayuki, uh, which I don't really know what to say about Mayuki. I kind of forget the lore of her, to yeah. be honest. Her dialogue in this game is like abysmal. <laughs> she's, she's kind of like a, another so gang leader, uh, and and we're gonna try and recruit her to our team, basically. Yeah. Okay, so we have a setup for this as well. Let's see if we can make it work. Got to fire Yo-Yo. Fine, fine, okay. No, I did it again. Why <laughs> do I keep forgetting to... Ah. Uh, uh, that is bad. Okay, we have a backup. I think we can do this. Oh, okay, Ooh. fine. That should work, maybe? Nice. Oh, yeah. nice. Okay. Good backup. Ooh, got the backup. <laughs> Three boys. Three boys. Very nice. Ultra ticket 18. Yeah, yeah so that is uh, the item I picked up in, in the, on the second floor, uh, which will make me run faster when I equip it. Uh, and from now on, we're actually going to be using Mayuki um, because she is a little bit easier to line up some of the quick kills on the bosses. Um, and she has this AOE attack that she does. Yeah, which we didn't realize for a while was like insanely busted. Yeah. Nope. Uh, Mayuki has like two attacks. She can either like swing the yo yo forward, which usually just hits one enemy, or this big spiral attack that just hits everything around it. It has a massive hitbox. So for that reason, Mayuki is just like really, really good. All right. Subway, the start of Subway, we're just running and avoiding enemies. So again, if there's anything to read, go yeah, ahead. That would be a perfect time. We yeah. do have things to read. We have a donation from Oranea of $10 with the message, street voice, more like Budstein Buben. <laughs> <laughs> and that also went to the uh, uh, Jedi Knight language choice of French. Uh, thank you so much, Aura. Yeah, just keep on going. We have uh, a lot of running here. Sure. Uh, we have $25 from King Europe sending a message, road rascals. <laughs> 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 Can we just get like a train of Street Boys adjacent yeah. game titles? Please keep the donations oh, rolling yeah. in, guys. Let's get a train yeah. going. Yeah. Speaking of trains, we're running on train tracks right now. But there is that no train. Perfect. There's no train now. Yeah. Look at this. This is going to get sick. Nice. Money. <laughs> Hit max. <laughs> so that's the uh, Thug Monthly Magazine, which gives, <laughs> you, which gives you a full meter in the bottom left. That uh, yellow gradient to uh, like red meter is effectively what allows War Drums to do that. So. By hitting a triangle and circle, I think, right? Yeah. You can do like a like a Kamehame. Uh, but if you uh, have Mayuki's or just your partner's R2 attack active at the time, you can do a team super, yeah. which you saw before, which is also just a big AOE attack. Which I've accidentally done twice now already <laughs> when, I, when, when I didn't mean to. Yeah. Um, Mayuki can actually die here during this section, yeah. or at least take a lot of damage, which is not ideal. So Wardrums will be like triggering her R2 just to keep her alive because she's very, very necessary for the boss. Okay, so here we have a uh, another door clip that's coming up and it is a little bit finicky and definitely requires this guy to cooperate. And he oh, not. come on. Maybe. Oh, that's, oh, nice. oh, that's perfect. That's the big guy got stuck. Yeah, nice. There we yeah. go. Yeah. Very so nice. when you door clip, you're just... <laughs> Three boys. When, when door clipping, you're just walking up to the door with an enemy behind you, well, most enemies, and then you just neutral jump uh, and, and it just clips you through. <laughs> which is super fun and very easy to do on uh, a lot of the doors. It's like one of my favorite fences in the game there, by the way. You'll hear another one. Oh, it's, yeah, ex yeah. it's extremely loud for just no reason. Okay, so Mayuki is looking quite healthy, but I'm just gonna, just for the sake of uh, safety, I'm gonna pick up some back of health here. A recovery burger. All right, re ready? <laughs> <laughs> so loud. Yeah. Oh, camera. Okay, let's see if we can get this. this oh, room is what very is this tough. guy doing? Okay, we're gonna try that. Maybe? Yeah, they're lined up. No, oh, I missed the guy. Dang it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, this, this room's tough in pretty much every category, no matter what. And Mayuki's not doing her AoE attack? Yeah, Mayuki tends oh, to not... <laughs> Mayuki tends to not do the AoE attack when she's right next to the enemies. Typically, she'll... If she's a bit away, she'll run over and start doing it. 
So this is yeah. just like really unfortunate positioning. There's not much you can do other than like maybe push the enemies out of the way, but then you're not dealing damage to them either. So, and also we have no weapon, so this is really slow. Oh, that was nice. okay. okay. That's that's okay. Yeah. Thanks, Mayuk. <laughs> <laughs> My Yuri. <laughs> Shout out, Rebel. Yeah. Most enemies we just run run past, but that room is uh is quite forced that you you have to fight those. Uh, technically, you also have to do that in the first room and this one coming in here. So um, we got another clip right here. If you look at the very top of the screen, you might see in an elevator. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> Just another terrible translation. Boys. Three boys. Three boys. Oh, that's what this is. <laughs> oh, <fuck. laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, is that what we're playing? Oh, damn. Maybe it's not. Let us know in the donations. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> What is it that we're actually playing? Yeah. Uh, just another safety health there for Mayuki. Playing the McDonald's simulator with the recovery burger. Yeah. Okay, so coming the, up yeah, is go ahead. probably the most annoying uh, boss fight, uh, especially in any percent. So I have a lineup or a setup for the quick kill, but Joe likes to do just Joe things, so we'll All see right. if I can, uh, I can actually get it. We'll just witness this. He'll be very happy if I get it. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. So that is intentional to uh, kill all of the minor goons in the room. We go over here. Grab this. Oh, this is not ideal. Maybe it is okay. It's fine. And. Oh, dang, it didn't get it. Oh, nice try. Decent bit of damage still. Press yeah. buttons! Press buttons! Also, stare down. <laughs> <laughs> and yes, this guy's name is just Joe. <laughs> Joe versus Jin. And now this is where this fight can go a little hairy. Come on! Oh, nice. Oh, my, oh, okay. Mayuki. Mayuki got it. Clutch. Okay. Handled it. Clutch, yep. Mayuki. Whew. Okay, that's fine. Very nice. It was worth a B. <laughs> get a B for effort. Nice. All right, so now is the, uh, the hospital coming up where we have to uh, switch to Shizuke because for some reason uh, he really likes um, Mayuki's little sister <laughs> who's apparently been trapped at the hospital by some goons. Um, yeah, so he wants to play hero. Yeah, so, we yeah. so the game forces us to swap to him. He's got the like the worst attacks out of all the partners. Yeah, like we'd kid. much rather take Mayuki or Genji. Yeah, we never use him apart from this specific stage in any percent. Yeah. Because the game forces us too. He just has these wooden yeah. sandals that he claps. We'll clip here. Nice. Nice. Yeah. That Good. is. You're gonna see a lot of those here. Yeah, you're meant to kind of go around the hospital and pressing like switches to like open the <laughs> shutter opens. <laughs> you're meant to like open these shutters and and like you can yeah, see there's at the roof right now and the blue ones are closed. You're meant to like. Hit the switch, which opens the blue ones, closes the red ones. It's kind of a puzzle level. Yeah. But yeah, this is actually where these clips were found for the first time. Yeah. These jump clips here. Yep. Oh, I'm going for the throw one. I like this. Nice. Yeah. yeah, that one's tough. I usually go for a different one that is slightly faster with the uh, with the red uh, with, with the lady in red. Mm -hmm. um, but this one, uh, Rebel just showed me this one earlier, or reminded me that it exists, <laughs> uh, and how easy it is. So I just went for that instead, and it is very free when you know the setup. Now we need the key. Yeah. I'm actually gonna use Shizuke here to start attacking those goons because they have a uh, nice little pipe that we can uh, utilize for the boss fight. <laughs> he just whiffed. Oh, nice! That was uh, that was a counter hit. Yeah. How's he holding that thing? <laughs> oh my god, the music's so good. In every stage, yeah. basically. Okay, so this Harbor? Is, this is, yeah, we don't talk about Harbor. Yeah. Um, so this is one of the few uh, boss fights that is actually not a boss fight, but just a, a goon squad ganging up on you. Uh, I'm just gonna... Oh, no. Oh. Come on. Oh, oh. no! <laughs> okay, this is... Every fight is just going from bad to yeah, worse. Yeah, this might get hairy. So if you get knocked down while holding a weapon, you lose it instantly, yeah. which is pretty vital just because it's not that the attack animation is much better or anything. I mean, uh, there's a bigger swing on it, but it's it's the strength bonus you get by holding a weapon. Yeah, we deal so, like no damage here. So the first time Wardrums can get a weapon is by defeating this 
guy that he's punching right now. Yeah. Once he dies, he can grab his bat, and then it'll speed up the fight a little bit. We're getting a nice combo going, though. Look at this, 36. I'm going to try and do... Oh, I wanted to do that. Just to knock everybody over and deal some extra damage. <laughs> but yeah, there I, I kick him to knock him over specifically, so he drops his weapon faster. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> There's no one on the ground hitting the gritty. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. So yeah, now we did <laughs> a lot more damage. Oh, camera. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's probably like triple of just hitting with the fist. And again, knocking him over <laughs> to uh, have the uh, end screen come up faster. That's very nice. Also, right. uh, was okay. Don't forget to switch to Mayuki. Thank you. <laughs> 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 Forgot in the practice round. Though. Yeah, it's bad. Need some more text matching. I think we have some time for some more uh, donations. Awesome. Uh, we have a ten dollar donation from John Street saying <laughs> Street. <laughs> and coincidentally, we have another ten dollars from John Boys <laughs> saying <laughs> Boys. <laughs> Perfect. Street Boys. So uh, this is the. Uh, thank you, John. Yeah, thank you very much. Uh, so this is the infamous uh, High School Two, where or the revisit where we get the uh, the, the story that. We can talk. Oh, nope. I need to get the broom again. IL muscle memory. Uh, we get the broom strat again. So, camera. That worked really well. Yeah, you, as, as all schools do, you just have an entrance to the basement the toilets. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just the staircase there. Also, some more uh, models of guys here. I'm just gonna jump for the yeah, safety of it. Yeah, you get knocked down if you get hit by those, so you really oh that's close. You really don't want to get hit by that because you lose the broom immediately. Yeah. Also, and look look at him sweeping the floor there. <laughs> like cleaning duty. Yeah. Uh. Very we, nice. we just gotta do this for a little while. <laughs> this is actually good a good time for some more donations. We're just gonna be swinging <laughs> these guys for a while. Absolutely. Uh, Rebel Dragon 95 donates ten dollars, saying, "Street boys, Yo, Rebel, Street boys, boys." Oh, fuck. thank you, Rebel. Uh, we also have five dollars from nope. Sly Sonic with a message. Oh, Wait, cool. six. What's this game called again? I don't know. What is it called? <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah. So, yeah. so these guys have the true wooden katana, which is the strongest weapon in the entire game. It deals so much damage. It's like golf, where, where wood is the best one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at this. It deals like a third of their like health bar. It's pretty much used in like almost every IL, more or less. It, it there, is. Yeah. Apart from a few one. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Could have been one fun with the one twenty four. Yeah. Very nice. Now we're going into my uh, least favorite level, which is ten quarter, um, because so much things can just go wrong. We're gonna pick up a. I'm <laughs> <laughs> gonna pick up a little uh, little claw weapon, uh, and the longer we can keep that in in the level, the better, because it deals more damage than your regular fists. But there is some guys that really like to knock you over with a like roundhouse kick. So I know we've seen some reused assets, but genuinely, this is probably one of the most well-made levels in the game. It's got great music. It's just got a nice like city vibe. It's actually fire. Oh yeah. Also, these guys, uh, JP, uh, if you uh, want to represent. <laughs> <laughs> With the hair. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> shout outs. Shout outs to JP. Yeah, shout outs to uh, the original. Oh, yeah, it's all of the Street Boys for that matter. Yeah, the original uh, Street Boys. <laughs> all right, let's see if we can get this gate clip without getting knocked over. Oh, come on. Sometimes they just don't want to walk. Then yeah, if, if their paths collide, they just don't walk forward. Yeah. I, I oh. like to call them Canadians because they are like, no, you first. No, you first. No, you first. <laughs> All right, so one okay. of these guys has a key. This guy specifically. Ah, oh, yeah. Yep. They just randomly like to knock you over, and there's nothing you can do about it. You, like, you can parry, but you can't react to, the, to parry them in time. Yeah, and I think there's not really any other weapons, like, no, at this isn't. point. Yeah. Uh, I think it's this guy. Ah! <laughs> so we get that elevator key to uh, oh, 
Come on. That, the, yeah, I was about to say, these enemies have a okay. really, really strong roundhouse kick that just instantly knocks no, my you Yuki. over. Oh my god, this is so... Okay, uh, where do we have backup health? That is, okay, this is kind of bad. Okay, uh, we restart. <laughs> I don't care. Yeah. It, it was going bad anyway. Yeah, it was it was pretty dicey. Yeah, if Mayuki dies, it's it's uh, the the boss fight is really bad as well. This is why I hate this. Uh and also why the estimate yeah, is so much higher <laughs> than my PB. It's a generous estimate because any oh. mistake can suddenly cost a couple of minutes. Yeah, and also we're just not really getting any money either, so like we're not yeah. going to the mall that you're supposed to kind of go to every now and then to like buy upgrades and stuff like that. We're not collecting any of the Zenny and things like that. So we are like, we're just like low on health, no weapons. The, it's just the famous Japanese currency of Zenny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And this is also why nobody runs this category. Street Boys because... in 480 Zen. Oh, because it's really bad. <laughs> oh, that nice. oh, instant. Nice. Very nice. That looked really weird. Yeah, I was about to say, that was the sketchiest <laughs> clip I've seen in my life. You're trapped. Defeat the enemies. Yeah, it's almost impossible to react to the roundhouse. Yeah, it, it just comes it just, out of nowhere. Nothing you can do. Like it's just like invincible. Oh my god. And and you can see the the guys in blue are covering Mayuki's like being able to run over to these guys. So that's why she's not doing the Bubble. attack. Might actually die now. Just gonna do that. Don't do it. Oh. oh my god, oh. I, I felt that. Yeah, good dodge. Good. Oh, I there. think there's... Thank you. Yeah, there uh, might actually, be... Actually, we can actually just... Um, I shouldn't get hit until the next uh, health. I, I would usually go for that if it's my Yuki that's on low health. But I think we should be fine. In an elevator. In an elevator again. We just go up, over, and down. Should we do the lag? The lag strat? Yeah, let's give it a go, because sometimes it... There are just a few... Uh, Spots in this game where the, the game just likes to lag a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of them. Nice. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we should be fine. We still don't have a weapon, but it, yeah, I'm, I'm used to that at this point. <laughs> yeah. This uh, so that big blue door is the boss of the level, but first we have an encounter with these four guys here, which. Again, it's just like really rough without a weapon, but it's like you're just expected to lose the weapon in this. There's not really much you can do. And Wardrums has to keep his super. You would think the team super would deal like good damage to it, but it's just so much better to keep it for the boss, and you'll see exactly why when we get also, there. Also, the team super deals like no damage this early on. In oh god. Okay, actually, I'm actually gonna do uh, do the command here because there is a backup super I can do use. Uh, oh yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you can go grab that. Like do that and then. But these are a lot of damage, sweet boys. Uh, that deals a lot of damage, but it's not great. We're just gonna grab that there. Yep. To, uh, make sure we have that for it later. Uh, there's one guy left. I'm gonna let Mayuki deal with them because I don't want to. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Eat bike! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sometimes the uh, grab hitbox is a little finicky. You get to hear the music though. Oh, yeah. I'm just gonna block. <laughs> yeah. This is way too dicey for uh, what I would like. Come on. Okay. Nice, okay. We're, we're not out of the woods yet. We still have the boss fight. Yeah. Yeah. We're inside the chat. So here we have a, a double boss fight, basically, uh, with uh, Leland and Riku. Um, Riku's a big man. Oh, come on, man. You can hit him. Oh, that's bad. Yeah. Right, whatever. Oh, Maybe? That's late. Um, I, I got confused. Okay, okay you got a double hit on yeah. that. It's not too bad. Oh, my God. I've got to. Okay, we're, we're doing backup strats all day. Uh, there we go. Okay. And uh, Burgers might, as, might as well grab this weapon over here. Yeah, so Don't you. Get hit by that. Yeah, so you will see a stare down around when Leland's around half. But Wardrops is going to focus on Riku first. Really uh, unfortunate losing the weapon. <laughs> yeah. That's the only one here, I believe. Yeah, it is. Ayuki's not doing anything either. Okay, a couple hits there. But yeah, you can drain his health bar down to half immediately because. In the middle of his like animation, 
you can you can hit him twice with the uh, with the command. Oh, let me do that. Okay, sure. What? <laughs> You've never seen that before? No. <laughs> it is. Uh, Could be good. I'm gonna gonna hit Lil in there. Uh, Dang. Uh, it. I just come to this. Yeah, okay. The thing, the, the thing with the boss strats in this game is like they either work or you're just like done. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, you have to. You have to. I think I'm gonna do maybe. The full game runs of this game are like really punishing each other. Though. I'm gonna try and force. No, come on, my Yuki hitter. I don't want to do double stare down. That's what I'm trying to. Do. If you, there's two ways you could get stare down. Uh, if it's, she's below half health. Or if it's been like 30 minutes, um, but if she's done the below, below half health first, she doesn't do the 30 minutes or the 30 seconds one. Is what I'm trying to say. Mm -hmm. um, so that's what I was trying to manipulate there. Because if I went up to her before this stare down or before she was uh, below half health, she would have done two stare downs back to back, and that sucks. Yeah, <laughs> she's a bit of a coward and <laughs> does not. We trap her in the corner like this. Oh, she got out. Okay, it's fine. There we go. Oh, I hate this fight so much. Yeah, it's <laughs> super hard. Three boys. Such a hard stage. Yeah. I mean, there's just so few weapons there, and there's just like not much you can do if you lose it. The enemies are just super tough. Now we get into uh, Harbor, which uh, has some of the best music for sure in the game. Right, guys? Yep. Yeah, get ready for this. One. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a banger. This one? This one's fire. <laughs> get your playlists ready. Yeah, you're going to want to add this one later. All right. You ready? Yep. Here we go. <laughs> oh, look at listen to that. Yeah, I love that boat horn or whatever it is. Uh, probably fit a donation in this <laughs> section. <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna dodge some enemies, grab a weapon, and then keep on going. So uh, a donation would be good. Absolutely. We have a five dollar anonymous donation with a message. Love me some mischief men for the Sony PlayStation <laughs> 2. <laughs> Another one? Yeah, Shutter, sure. Shutter open. We have $10 from Desk Semi. Very cool event. Extremely good donation goal. Alzheimer's has been influencing my family for a decade now, and I'm praying for science to make a big breakthrough before it's going to affect my mother. You're doing the good work, people. Keep it up. Shout out to oh the my God, I just got it. <laughs> Sorry. Three <laughs> boys. Uh, Three boys. Sorry, that was a lovely, lovely donation. Yeah, thank that, you that, very that, much, that, that jump is so, just really hard. <laughs> keep, keep going <laughs> if there was more. Yeah, we do have actually uh, another one. Uh, Alco donates $25 and says, Hello, lame lads. <laughs> because I just heard the famous Japanese currents of Zenny, I thought I would just drop in that Zenny means coin, and suddenly it makes sense. Anyway, Ooh. keep on uh, roading and roguing. Thank you so much, Alco. Three boys. So yeah, once again, we have one of these uh, goon fights before a, f a boss fight, and we're just going to swing at them. And oh. they yeah. <laughs> oh, nice! You got the triple. I love how I've never actually like really heard the the hit sound until now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> True. And knocking the last guy over to make him his uh, death animation faster and uh, open up this. So now it's time for a rematch with Joe. Uh, he's back. And he's in a giant digger, and we have... He's upgraded a bit. Yeah, and we have to throw these barrels at him. That's, like, pretty much the only way to damage him. We just have to hope Mayuki doesn't stand in the way of these barrel throws. Avoiding the stare down oh, here is really? basically impossible. It, it, getting an NG plus is even, like, really hard. Yeah. And we have no idea why that... Uh... Hang on a second. Oh, Hang please. on a second. Oh, please. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Maybe. What? What? I have never found this in, the, in, in any of my practice. Come on. No! no! <laughs> oh, if that barrel hit, no! that was it. Why oh, why let go? That's close. I've never gotten the stare downs given in, in practice. What? Oh, my God. <laughs> Damn. Okay. I didn't even know that was doable in any percent. I need to look at, look at the replay for that. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so yeah, when, when you die, it's, it's very brutal and you have to do the entire stage over. Oh, I got the, the box jump. Oh. <laughs> I got the box jump first try. <laughs> now I have to do it again. Uh, okay. All right, let's go back to reading some stuff. Yeah, yeah, read <laughs> some more stuff. <laughs> Take me out of the We misery. have stuff. 
Uh, we do, in fact, have uh, $10 from Street John with the message, <laughs> I love Pathway Homies. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's... Thank you, John. <laughs> Yeah, so this section, just like, just because we didn't go over it before, this is uh, platforming, yeah. <laughs> like genuine platforming. It's awful because the jump is insanely stiff, and you can kind of skip a good. Oh, oh, nice! So close. Very nice try. Getting the back up here. Yeah, the back up's not much easier. Nice. That was that was good. This one is it's fairly okay. Yeah. yeah, it's just, I mean, it's just so stiff. I, like, you're not supposed to jump those ways. You're supposed to go like a way further, a way around. Yeah. Um, you need to go a long way around yeah, for yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. All right, we're gonna get some more. <laughs> oh, the four. Oh, almost the four. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> One of my favorite, like, I don't know if it's a translation or if it's just, like, something they actually meant to put in, but when you're about to enter a boss level, uh, the, the info box says the enemy stench is stronger than usual. <laughs> <laughs> and then it's like, what? Don't split up and... Yeah, we, we can take a look at it. This run is... is oh, they died at the same time. Okay. We can take a look at it here because it's, it's quite funny. Come on. There and str stench is stronger than usual. We made it, or let's split up. Yeah. <laughs> when you try and uh, re-enter the prison, it also just says, like, uh, quiet, caught, or I won't go, as yeah. yes and no. What did I do? I don't remember. <laughs> let's just try something here. All right, so let's see. If you spin, yeah. That, yeah. That's, that's what normally yeah, happens. That usually happens. For some reason, he did the spin there before. Again, right around... <laughs> oh yeah, this is the best <laughs> stare down yeah. in the game. Because <laughs> it's like all the way up. Makes no sense. We still win. Because we pressed buttons harder. And yay! There we go. Joe's down. We got through. Yep. And now we're coming up to uh, the last level of the, of the game, uh, which is Sunshine Building. Um, actual building, by the way. Actual yeah. building. Honestly, one of my favorite levels in the game, just for like all the wrong reasons. <laughs> you'll see exactly what we mean. But you'll, yeah, I mean, you can see it at the very top. Uh, you know, it's this towering building on the world map here. Yeah. This is it. Yeah. So you've you've heard this like nice little guitar music, Tenu had that smooth jazz. Uh, this music takes a turn. Yeah. yeah. This goes hard. Also, it's time for. Uh, <laughs> The last door clip to uh, the game. Oh, I went too, a little too fast there. Come on, <laughs> why do they do this? There we go. The crowd's loving it. <laughs> yeah, for some reason it's just like really, really fast, like BPM on it. So again, there's 50 floors, and you might be thinking like, oh god, we're we're in for a tree here. Um, but we oh, won't there's, be... There's 60 floors. Oh yeah, 60. <laughs> but we won't be doing all the floors. I mean, here, here you can see, uh, this is supposed to be kind of like a shopping area. You got some... Some rock. You got some J-pop there. More rock? Yeah, more, more Recommend. rock. Recommend? <laughs> Recommend? <laughs> I didn't know that. And we go to the third floor, which is kind of like an arcade yeah. type of deal. Um, just a lot of the same machines for some reason. Yeah. Catcher game. I think they got a little lazy with the assets, but yep. that's what it is. So right during this moment, maybe somewhere in this room, the developers probably were told like, oh, yeah, you have like a week. <laughs> we need we need this game we, out we now. We need this out now. Okay, so uh, skip skip to floor ten. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, okay. so they're like skip to floor ten, uh uh, uh hallway. <laughs> Put it in. <laughs> okay, okay, how how do we make this uh, this level longer? Um uh, uh what, what do we do? Uh, uh, um, more, more hallway, more, more hallway, more, more hallway. More <laughs> hallway. <laughs> it's like oh we we can't do this we can't do this forever. Uh warehouse storage floor room. <laughs> floor ten, right? Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. They just started really copy-pasting things <laughs> around this this area here. Uh, on a little serious note, Mayuki is dying, so we gotta pick up some uh, some backup health here. Yep. I usually do that anyway. Oh, she's actually dying. Okay, it's fine. okay, good. <laughs> We're good uh, to go to yeah, the next hallway. One more hallway. So yep. uh, if you have some uh, messages, please uh, please take us out of this misery. 
Well, we have a five dollar donation from John Danmark. I think gather dränge. Gather dränge. That's the thing. That's the thing. Yeah. Talk, Thank talk. You so much, John. Oh, yeah. uh, which way would we go? Oh yeah, left of course. <laughs> and more hallways. Yeah, more marble. Hallways. Hallway guys. <laughs> Hallway guys, yeah. And and more storage. Yep. And like on your first time through, there's just like no indication of where to go. Look at the radar in the top right, by the way. It is a mess. Like there's there's actually just no map at all. It's just like a, a compass. Yeah. It like, shows you yeah. the exact location of the next like loading yeah. trigger or or something where you have to go, yeah, but not, no not, reference yeah. or no anything path. or no yeah. path. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's just it's not useless. relative to where you are at all. It's yeah. Just like, oh yeah, more it's more over hopefully. there. Yeah, it's here. And yeah, here here's where they got really pushed. So uh, okay, let's just uh, let's just go to floor fifty. <laughs> yep. Good boys. So this room has like, like. A, a split a, like staircase, and we're gonna go up to the right because we need a key. Yeah, you can tell the developers were like especially proud of floors between 50 and 60 because you can just skip them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can also go through them, but we're not gonna do that because that's slow. Yeah, and you have to do a lot of force fights, uh, actually force fights. That takes forever. Yeah, so this door on the left would take you to the path where you actually do all of the 10 floors with just like forced battles over and over again. Not that this game has an issue with, you know, copy-paste content, but... <laughs> yeah. uh, just the last backup health for Mayuki here. So yeah, we're, we're able to just take an elevator. When I say skip, I mean there's just an elevator to take you to the top. Yep. Yeah. I can't wait for the top floor, just what it says on the loading screen. <laughs> yeah. It just doesn't make any sense. Nothing in this game makes sense. Yep. <laughs> Apart from it's the fact that it's Street Boys. Yep. Street Boys. <laughs> Back to these guys. We're just gonna run straight past them. <laughs> man, the composer, man. I want to meet that guy. <laughs> For sure. So yeah, we're coming up uh, on on the end of the of the game soon. Uh, one last elevator in an elevator ride. Yeah, we're going, going to floor 59. Which they put a little bit of effort into. There's yeah, like a yeah, carpet. Carpet and, uh, and pillars and, and some gray and some, marble. Some, some and, yeah. yeah. What, do you, what do you think is at the very top of this 60 well, What would you build? put on floor 60? No, an, no, aquarium, an, an aquarium, of course. Of course. <laughs> so this oh. is the final boss, Q key. And, right. and he has a right. massive robot for some reason. Let's see if this quick kill... Good. Yes. Yeah, there we go. Nice. All right. So, and on time. Get ready on time. Time. There we go. <laughs> Three boys. Woo. <laughs> Three boys. <laughs> Here's Look the at this room right now. Uh, so yeah, the story is that uh, <laughs> the story actually was that Kyuki here wanted to take over the world as the Greatest thug in the world. <laughs> so now he's defeated. So he just uh, he explodes. Yeah. In a ball of light. Yeah. And there's a, like a bunch of broken glass sounds and stuff. That's so weird. Um, but yeah, I think we're gonna uh, gonna say that's it for for Street Boys. Yeah. Get one last Street Boys. Street Boys. Yo, shout out uh, to the PlayStation Nation. Yeah. yeah. And all of it the Street Boys and everybody here. Thank yeah. you so much. Thank you for being here. It's been lovely. Uh, <laughs> very entertaining run. Yeah. Even though I messed up so many strats. It's a hard category. It's, it's a really hard category. Stick uh, around, it's a big day. Yeah. yeah, yeah, for sure. There's so many amazing runs today, but uh, we're gonna send it back to uh, back to you. Thank you so much, War Drums, for that very entertaining <laughs> run. Uh, don't go anywhere. We will very soon be back with a Jedi Knight uh, run, so we'll go to a short intermission, and then we'll be back for that. Thank you so much.